From there to here, from here to there. There are dumpsters everywhere. And we're on our way to find some. That's a pretty big bike. Two free bikes. Someone's throwing away. And as our little girls get bigger, they will have bikes to grow into. That's kind of like a mountain bike, isn't it? Yes. That's kind of a big bike to have training wheels on it, isn't it? Speed McQueen. Looks like someone's had a lot of fun with this bike. This has really been used for lots of fun. A little dumpster diving at the Arthur Murray Dance Studio Dumpster. Empty? Oh, how sad. It's actually Dollar Tree. Though there is an Arthur Murray Dance Studio here. This one isn't empty. It's not empty. It looks like a lot of boxes and things. That's what about that dumpster? Is that the one we just looked in? Is it? Let's see the other half of the oh. <laughs> Okay. How about half the use rolls of paper towels? Hey! Like yeah! A thousand of them. Really? <laughs> well, there you go. Oh my gosh, look at that! <gasps> they changed out the paper towels in the bathroom and just threw away. Oh, got some bags, too. Oh my uh, god, this is definitely worth it. That's not stuff. bad. We do not take a year's worth of paper. Yeah, towel. we do not buy paper towel. We also got a bunch of packing material from the Bye Bye Baby dumpster already. We can show. You want to see some styrofoam? It's very exciting. This is more fun than. We don't need cookware. We need paper towels. Better to have them used before they go into the dump than to have unused paper towels go into the dump. Yeah. Even though it's good to clean up with rags and cloth, some things like cat vomit you just you want paper towel for now we're at the tractor supply company dumpster not at this tractor supply company but at a different one this lady yelled at frugal daddy for looking in the dumpster ouch i hit my elbow is there stuff <gasps> plants <gasps> pansies oh god yes my god. pansies pansies oh glorious those look nice what are these freaking things i know oh my god they're all over the place. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, people. Pansy Bonanza. Pansy Bonanza. There's a lot of them. Okay, everybody be quiet. Do not call attention to us. We must get the free flowers. I hear something rolling around out there. God, I hope they're not bringing trash out. No, no, they're not. Man, we are in stealth mode. Where's Frugal Daddy? Did he leave me here? Are you looking for the grabber? It's great. It's like under the plates. I know. Nothing to see here, people. Move along. Move along. Please keep the driveway clear. Yeah, we need to hurry. We need to hurry. Huh? We need to hurry. Is someone here? Oh, I hear something. I keep hearing something. something people I hear something I hear. This one's freaking gorgeous. Stop squeaking, stop squeaking. Oh my god, you got... Oh my god, oh my god. Ouch. Yeah, yeah. The car is pretty full. That was amazing. That was 
15 hanging plants of pansies and those are not dead flowers in the least. Those are going to be amazing. As you lay this sometimes, you say, you're, you're like confounded. You say, I can't believe that just happened. I know, that I can't was amazing. Someone threw know. those away. I can't believe we there were we there before the other guy yeah. <laughs> comes and finds all I didn't stuff. even tell you earlier, but I actually was thinking today it would be great to find flowers. I was, I was thinking that. I really was. You're just going to all have to believe me on that. We actually spent some money at Home Depot on some flowers that I put in the garden over the weekend. But I wanted more, and I, I, I was so enjoying planting them and gardening, and the garden is looking so much better that I wanted more flowers, and I love pansies. I'm, I'm totally, totally psyched. 15, 15, 15. But don't slam on the brakes because the pansies and the styrofoam are flying work. into my head. I used to work at like this. Okay. That was All a bank. Right. Okay, that's good. Let's say those pansies were $10 each, which I doubt because that would be way too cheap for a hanging plant. But let's say they were. That's $150 worth of flowers we just got free out of a dumpster. Frugal Daddy's all jazzed up from the adrenaline of the dumpster dive. So he's driving really fast and really crazy. And then what's happening right in front of us? It, if Stop! I were to him, There's a train coming! These are heavy duty trains are like 300 cars yes i have been stuck at this train crossing for at least half an hour one time because these are freight trains that have like 2,000 cars if i would have passed and that we're guy gonna be forever he wanted to pass someone it wouldn't have been appropriate limit. no you don't you said oh we have plenty of we time. do have plenty of time calm oh, down oh you want to see the train everybody oh <laughs> oh my god it was one car <laughs> It was just like the the little engine that could. There it goes. Bye bye. So it, it was not the eight mile long freight train that has stopped I mean, me here in the past. Can I go or no? Yeah, you can go. The arms went up. See, it didn't get in our way. Look at that. But you 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 can drive slowly and just enjoy life. You don't have to all be all hyped up. We're kind of on a backcountry road. And what do you think the speed limit is? Fifty. It is not. I know. I know the speed limit on this road. I don't know. It feels like you're going a little too fast. Let's calm you down with a little church music. Okay. Sing we something. Sing. You sing. Sing a gospel song. Uh, God is an awesome God. He went from heaven on earth. Uh, da, 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 um, Are you making that up? Uh, a mighty fortress is our God. Hey. Work, work never, never failing. failing. For churchy people, we don't really seem to know too many songs by heart. There's tons of them. I know there's so know. many. Why don't we know any? As a deer panteth o'er the water, so my soul longeth after you. It's God telling me to shut up. <laughs> Frugal Daddy just came up with a really great tip and an amazing life hack. Because someone told us that they were they needed our car because they were going to go return something to a store like Talbot's or something. Let's use that as an example. And I thought, if you don't buy anything, you don't have to return it. Ever. Simple life lesson for you right there. Home safe and sound, and here's the quick recap. So here are all the pansies we found in the tractor supply store dumpster. I am very excited about getting these into ground into ground into the ground and uh, i want to get some nice hanging plants on the front porch we got all of these ends of rolls of paper towels who knows why they would just throw these out but i guess when they replace them in the bathroom or the workroom the kitchen wherever it is they come from they want to put a big new roll up obviously they're just throwing out the old ones which is wickedly wasteful and these two bikes which may be a little bit rusty and i don't know how usable they are right now but bikes have parts and we need parts for our bikes we need tires we needed a pedal for neve's bike extra bikes are always really helpful we need tires we need tubes we need pedals seat there's a lot of good parts on these well there you go that's kind of an eclectic mixture of dumpster booty as always, frugal friends and dumpster diving enthusiasts, thanks for watching. See you next time. A couple of days have gone by, so here's the pansy update. I have several pots hanging 
out front. Unfortunately, we had these major storms the other day and tornado warnings, so it was super windy and the hanging plants got a little bit battered. Here's another. I tried to pluck off all the dead bits before I hung them up. They're really quite healthy. I put some in a pot on the front step. Got one hanging way up there by the porch. Put some in the ground over here. The stems are really long. Maybe I need to cut them way back. Got another one hanging at the back of the porch. Got to keep up with pulling off the dead bits. And we have two hanging by the back door, as well as the ones I planted in the garden. And there's a bunch more over here that are mixed in with some petunias and impatience and begonias. There's definitely a lot of life left in these. Bye-bye.